Hi my Leos, it's Jamie Zebra 23 I am doing your February mid-month uh, general tarot card reading for Leo Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm using the Rider Waite Tarot deck. Um, I've laid out five cards because it is a mid-monthly. Also I'm on Facebook, you should like me, it's Jamie Zebra 23 I also do private readings, personal readings. Um, they are seven or $25 for 15 minutes, $50 for 30 minutes, $75 for five zero minutes, 50 minutes. Um, Readings are done over the phone or through Skype. The method of payment is PayPal. Um, I also have a one question, one answer for $5 via email only. I'm on all kinds of social media, Twitter, Skype, YouTube, um, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. I'm in everything. Um, it's all Jamie Zebra 23 Also, my email is jamiezebra23 at gmail.com. Gmail. All right, so let's jump right in. We got the Queen of Wands in reverse. We got the Ace of Pentacles. We got the Wheel of Fortune. We've got the Page of Wands. And then we've got the Three of um, Wands. So a lot of fire here for my fire sign, Leo. Okay. So um, some of you are dealing with a, with a very jealous person because we got the Queen of Wands in reverse. So this is somebody who's very jealous. This is somebody unfaithful, a cheater. Um, this person may be cheating because of money. Maybe they're, they're just doing things for money. If you know what I mean? Because we got the... Ace of Pentacles right after that, and then the Wheel of Fortune. So somebody's in a business where um, where I feel like um, either a lot of women or a lot of men enjoy their company for money. Also, some of you are are feeling like somebody cheated on you because you don't have enough money, or you don't, or maybe you feel like you're not pretty enough. There's jealousy there. There's there's enraged and jealousy. So somebody is cheating, and you know about it. Okay. Also, for some of you, um, things are going to be good for with money. Leo, I feel like maybe you had a hard time, some hardships, some things going on. But um, all the doors are about to open. Leo, you guys are proactive. You guys have it going on. You always have. You always will. You guys are Leos. Everybody wants to have Leo energy. Yes. Life goals. My past, well, I guess I'm done. The only thing I can do is be a Pisces again because I'm at Pisces. That's the last past life. That's the, that's the last one. We go from Aries to Pisces. I'm at Pisces. I'm at my last one. That's, that's if I did everything right and I don't have to come back as a Pisces again. But I guess I used to be a Leo, so... <laughs> All right, so uh, Ace of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. So you guys have some big bucks coming in. You guys got good job opportunities coming in. You got good love coming in. These two cards together, you guys are unstoppable. The only th oh, the only thing missing is the Ace of Cups, but I know they say money can't buy you happiness, but I think it can. All right, guys. Also, for some of you uh, Leos that, that were hoping to hear from a fire sign, um, a Leo, a Sagittarius, or an Aries, they're going to call you. Also, if this is you watching this, hoping that your fire sign will call you, this is like an ex or somebody hoping, they're going to call you. All right, three of wands, ships coming in. I feel like uh, I feel like uh, for some of you that were with a fire sign, this could be you or somebody who was with you or you were with a fire sign. Um, I feel like when you guys were together, um, things were just better. Money was good. Um, your social life was better. So some, some of you were really pining away for your fire sign to come back. So that you can live again. So that your ships can come in. I feel like uh, you were a lucky charm for someone or somebody was a lucky charm for you guys. And you just want them to come back. You want the ball rolling, the ball of life rolling. Or you're just so heartbroken and you miss them so bad that your life is a standstill. Because we, because at the top of the deck, I normally don't do this, but I'm going to pull one. This this was has been calling out to me the whole time. We got the five of cups here. So this is saying that somebody took a big loss. Also, this could be a water sign that some of you were dealing with. A... Um, uh, Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio person, but they're not they are not feeling right, or you're not feeling right without them. Things need to change, but, okay, I'm going to pull another one. Don't tell, don't tell the other people this. Okay, so we got the Eight of Wands here, so it's looking like things are going to go back to normal very, very quickly, because we got the, um, the Eight of Wands here, so the Eight of Wands talks about great speed, and then right on top of that is the Chariot, and then right on top of that is the Six of Wands, so they're coming for you. Whoever you guys broke up with, they're coming back for you. So this could be an air sign, an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. This could be a fire sign, a Sagittarius, an Aries, or a Leo. This could be a water sign, um, a, um, um, ca a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. I don't see Earth here, but this is a general. But it looks, the sun card is here. So it's saying that everything's going to be really good with that. So whoever you're pining for, if this was a job, if this was a loved one, if this was a family member, if this is your children, they're coming back. So don't worry, the dark clouds are going. They're going to go quickly. From mid-month, February 2017, things are looking good for you, Leo. All right, ta-ta for now.